thank you, Carol. What advice would you give somebody or give to somebody who wants to share their personal stories, whether that be in a book or on stage, sharing you know, public speaking or storytelling? What piece of advice would you give to somebody who may be a bit nervous about sharing their personal stories? What you have to think of, it's your story. Although it's your story, it's not actually yours. And your, yep. your story is there for you to share and support someone else who might need, desperately in need of your story. So it's through other people's story that I was able to build myself. As I mentioned, I listen to a lot of motivational speak on, on YouTube. And Les Brown's story, for example, had made me who I am. And not just Les Brown, but there's many other which I do listen to. And it's yeah. their story who resonate with me. Because the thing is, with story, from years, since the time we were small children, yeah. story, we connect to story. You want to hear story. People feel as when, when you tell a story, that's the ultimate way to connect with someone. Yeah. If I want you to remember me, all I have to do is give you a story. Yeah. So your story you might think might be very personal or you might feel a little bit uncomfortable or ashamed of your story. But don't be ashamed of your story. Own your story. Your story, it's yours. It's okay. Whatever adversity you went through, yeah. it's fine. Share it. Because we all have our struggle. Yeah. So don't feel embarrassed with your story. Own it. So your advice is, if you have a story, you should share it. Definitely. You have a story. The story, it's all, you went through the story, but the, there's a purpose, there's a reason for that story. And that story should go out in the world and empower other people. Carol, thank you. I know that you're a public speaking and communication skills expert. So when you talk about sharing your story, having the courage to do that, from a technical perspective, from a, an expert view, when you are sharing that story on stage in front of others, is there one piece of advice you can give to people to say, you know, incorporate this into your story to help it to connect with others? When you speak, don't think of you giving a story, you telling the audience. Think of what is the audience need. Who are your audience? What do they need? And then yes. you tailor your speech according to the audience, according to the people. Because it's not about you. It's about the audience. Yeah. It's about what they need to hear, what they want to hear, regardless of what you think. It's about them. And my book is out there. It's no longer about me, although I was the one who went through this story. But mm. it's not about me. It's about you, other people. Yeah. What, how, what can my story mm. bring to your life? Uh, you're right, and it's good. It's a good point. In that it's, you know, stories will have, uh, a, a, be, will be set around a context, will be set around a, a message, maybe a central message or two, or maybe more. And it's actually been able to kind of distill that in a way that is meaningful for other people. Definitely, mm. it, it's so uh, you. You must detach from who you are, yeah, and connect with the audience or anyone that you have around you, because when you give. You'd be amazed yeah. what comes back.